Hello, gentlemen and ladies as well. I said that in the wrong order, but I don't really care. What's going on, guys? It's Tap in here, and welcome to another Call of Duty Ghost 1v1 singles wager match here. And he's going to be hosting Warhawk today. This is map two. If you guys want to see map one, make sure to check it out on my channel. That'll be uh, free. But here we go. I got the wrong class to start it off. Awesome. I'm just going to switch to an AR. I wanted to have a nade, and I was going to actually stun rush A, but I'm just going to sit back with an AR, I guess. But this dude ran. He mixed it up a bit. I'm not going to lie. The bomb has been planted. But that doesn't really matter. He probably has a vector. Because he just rushed planted. But just going to clear hear this. Could be doing a lap, obviously. No, oh, I almost had him, damn it. If I wasn't weak and I hit my shots, I could have killed him there. Because he saw me jumping on bombs, so he went right to kill me there. And I was, I faked him out completely, but I just missed my shots. If I was full health and I hit my shots, I probably could have had him. He would have been very upset. But that's all good. To start it off here, I think I'm going to go ahead and stun rush. Actually, no, I'm going to go blue tarp. I gotta be aware that this is his host, and I can't get too, too, too aggressive here. But didn't see anything there. Complete the mission, soldier. You're the only one left. Time's almost up. Alright, so I don't see where he is. I'm assuming he's B or somewhere else on the map. So I'm just going to go ahead and plant. And I'm going to try to get up top 18. Alright, looks like we're clear. So basically, in this spot, guys, I can see the bomb. So I can see if he jumps on it. And he most likely won't be able to see me. If he pops out of American, he can see like the tip of my head. But I'm just going to stay hidden here. I just saw him. I'm just going to not shoot. And just chill out and basically wait for him to jump on the bomb here. There we go. Job. Wasn't sure if I wanted to take shots because obviously taking shots would give away my spot. But I'm like, you know what? It doesn't really matter. We can kill him. He's not moving. But there we go. Switching sides. You know, I I don't know why people give away kills like that. Like he obviously lost the round because the bomb's not defused. But instead of just sh sitting there shooting, waiting to die, he should probably, you know, approach it in a, a more logical way, right? But don't see him here. Last man standing. Finish it. Could have sworn it. I, I'm just seeing things. I think today. I think that's what it is. I'm just seeing things, but he's not back spawn. Basically, I didn't want to push up American just because I was kind of worried that he'd be waiting for me there. I'm always cautious of that because a lot of people do that, and it's a good strategy. Really good strategy on singles. It's simply just. You know, waiting out and waiting for people to push B, but. There we go. I choked some shots there to start. I'm like, ah, shit. But we killed him. That would have been really ugly if I had not gotten that. But yeah, one, one issue that, uh, just in general Call of Duty, if you miss those first few bullets, sometimes it's really hard to recover. Like, I, I missed those first few shots, and then sometimes you're just like, you're, you panic, and you're just like, oh, shit, I missed my bullets. I'm going to, you know, my, your aim just goes crazy. But Search and destroy. luckily I re recovered from that a bit. We got the kill. Destroy the objective. Bomb well, I'm just going to go in a rush cross post here, and my plan is to, if he rushes up B, I'm going to try to jump out and kill him. 
But we don't see him, so I'm gonna lay it down. Simple as that. The bomb has been planted. It's all up to you now. The squad's counting on you. I'm gonna do a little bit of old-fashioned strat. I used to do a lot in singles. And basically, I'm waiting for him to cross in front of me. And if he does, the good play, good play. We lost that round, but we can still he got the ninja on me. Good play on his part. He probably saw me run away and was just like, I got this. Sides. That's the only thing that really breaks my strategy here is if he does go for the defuse. Good plan his part. But uh, I do have a kill advantage on him now that he went for the defuse. The so, uh, yeah. I got a kill advantage. I'm always nervous when I go there. If Oh, we just saw him. Oh! I didn't think he saw me. Luckily, I kept premiuming. I didn't just sprint at him right away. But I am melting people today. I like that. Well, not really today, but just, just now in singles. I'm, I'm killing people quick, pretty quickly. And normally, I feel like I get so many hit markers when I get into gunfights. But right now, I'm just I'm killing nice and smooth, and I like that. I like that. But right here, I'm just going to be going to my little spot. I had one person that did this, and they laid down, and I'm always cautious of people that sit in the spot. Because if you sit in the spot, I can always see you. The bomb has been planted. And for those of you that don't know about this spot, this is a hell of a spot to sit, guys. Land the bomb. It's quite the spot. And it works out a lot. And if my Xbox could not do that, that'd be fantastic. Might just unplug my connect. There we go. He's not too happy. Excellent job, team. Get ready for the Whenever people are laying down the bomb like this, it never makes me happy, so I'm sure he's not any happier. But one thing I've actually uh, started doing whenever I uh, they plant a bomb, usually what I do is I'll uh, either check it from behind so I can get an easy kill. Or when I pop on American window, I'll pre-aim that just in case. But obviously, popping out the window is always a risk because it could still melt you. You know, it's all you know. You're online, so you never know, dude. But we got our specials bonus. Actually, we got a quick draw going on here. Not bad. You're the only one left. Remember your training. I'm gonna be playing this one 50-50. I think. I'm just gonna sit in the corner here and wait it out. And almost every time I go here, the only way I really lose the round is if they plant B. Like, nobody ever shoots me in the back or anything. They always pop out into my reticle and I kill them because I'm pre-aiming, obviously. Or they plant, they start planting the bomb, I hear them, and I kill them off bomb. But this quick draw is... I don't know, it's just... Excellent job, team. Get ready wow. for the next round. I thought the zoo was good. I really did. But uh, apparently not. He just walked right past me. And any good singles player would know that this is a common spot. And they like they wouldn't go out of their way a whole lot to like no, like navigate around that spot, but they would at least check the spot. Like everybody checks that. Come on, dude. You're better than that. Well, I'm going to go ahead and rush across B and just see if he's rushing me. And we don't see him red truck watching cross, so I'm gonna lay it down, I think. It's all up to you now. Finish this. The bomb has been planted. Do a little bit of a lap here. We just checked bomb, so I should be good on the bomb. And I can't see it that well from back here, but I will be able to see it at least. And anyway, he saw me for sure. I gotta make sure to check that bomb because he obviously likes to defuse. And he gets outplayed with that lap. I like it. 
outplayed him completely, baby. Let's go. This dude actually wasn't that hard. Um, I thought it was going to be a good competition, but I took him down pretty easily. Um, haven't done a singles match in a long time. And I did one match to warm up, and then I jumped right into a wager match, and I actually took him down pretty easily with a 6-2-6-2. Six, two, six, two. And uh, that second, this map right here that I just beat him on, that's my worst map. I almost always lose this map. But I feel like I'm playing it more because before, whenever I played singles, I would have this mindset on Warhawk where I would just be like, you know what, this map is complete luck. I'm not even going to try. I feel like that's what I would do way too often is I would play it 50-50, and I would basically say to myself, if I lose this, it's not my fault. It's just luck. I lost the coin toss, basically, is what I would think of it. But I got to get my get out of that mindset and... You know, I took him down on my, my worst map, so I'm definitely happy about that, and we'll take the dollar. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a like, and if you'd like to see more, let me know in the comments. And obviously, like the video if you want to see more singles. Um, I'd be glad to do some. I'm enjoying singles right now, and we'll see how I'm enjoying it once I lose a map. But we're going to keep on rolling with these videos on the video grind here today at 1 a.m. So, yeah, <laughs> that's how it's going down. Hope you guys enjoy. If you did, make sure to like the video, as I said already. And that's all for today, guys. As always, I'll catch you guys in the next one.